All right, we're giving these another go, and uh, yeah, feeling a little better with them here, but we will see uh, which 12-year-old just beats me by half a lap this time. Hopefully it's uh, a clean race. There's one guy that was in practice just trying to wreck everyone, so I'm hoping... Um, that he is not in here, and it looks like we're clear, so that's good. Let's see, I got this off OSR, let's see if we can drop the fuel a bit, 30 laps, try to get out here and get some laps made real quick. Try to figure out if we can make it on fuel with 1.1. I think that'll get us 40. But not 100% sure yet. It's going to be real close. It looks like 31 laps is saying what we can do. Well, that's loose. A little too low. 16.964 Do I want to tighten this up at all? Maybe? I was working with like a little brake drag on corner entry in practice, which felt pretty good. Kind of balances the car out, kind of like the midget. That's going to use up a little bit more fuel, but um, car stopped up high. It looks like we should be good to use 1.1 gallons. And as the track slicks off and the tires get hotter, we'll probably start lifting more, which will use a little less fuel too, so I think we'll be okay. We'll just go with that, and uh, hope I don't run out on the last lap. Turn this off. Let's do a real quick refresh of paints. But, uh, yeah, this is a weak field, so maybe I'll be able to get a win. I don't think I've ever won in this. Maybe I've won a random one at Eldora a long time ago, but I'm sure I will find a way to be slow. Um, kind of tends to always happen. I race down to my competition. Okay, here comes your first time lap. Try to hit a good lap here. One more lap. 16.54. 16 16.5, I think that will work. If we can get a little further up. I would be just fine with that, but not going to. Just outside of it. Alright, there's the ticket flag. Okay, well, right now we're on pull. Is that going to last? It's kind of fun to run these things that I've never ran. So, doing the asphalt and the dirt is uh, cool. I'm glad they got rid of the... Uh, or the rock screen that you can turn off and on because that rock screen was horrible on this thing.
But yeah, 30 laps should be a nice quick race. And uh, well, we're done with qualifying and we've got two tents on the field. So good job OSR set, I guess. Uh, they only have it for a few tracks though. So I'm gonna have to kind of work um, with the sets a bit when we go to other tracks, but I don't even know if this visits up on the inside. most tracks. Road is closed right now. Um, honestly, I've never really paid much attention to this car, so. Put up session best and for everyone that joined. Although, now that I've joined early, we are using just a bit of fuel right now sitting here on the grid. But, still think we're going to be okay. Try to decide what gear we're going to start in. Third gear, I think. And, uh, yeah, we'll see what happens here. Catch the pace car. Give myself a bit of a gap. Stay right within catch the limit of it saying catch, catch the, the pace, pace car. car. And we will, uh, kind of listen to the guy on the outside. Try to catch him anticipating. Get ready, going green. Post car is off, time to do your job. Green flag, green flag. Alright, caught him in a lift. Got about five laps of so, fuel now we gotta just pull away. Get a gap and then... We should be good on fuel still. Looks like it's okay, so. So far they've been clean behind. That's good. I don't really want anyone to wreck to the point where we have to deal with lap traffic. But with it being a single split and only 1,300, um, we may have to deal with lappers. Point five two. Just gonna do lift off. Right now we've got the field covered. Will that stay that way? I don't know. But at the moment, it looks like we're okay. Sixteen point six four five. Cast off download. Cast off download. And it begins. I don't see anyone, so that's good. So yeah, this uh, this car here feels a bit like the midget, um, just less less of a pitch, I think. But it actually feels pretty good here. I definitely uh, would say this is worth racing if you can find people running it. I got a little loose. 16.708. Try to stay up in the middle there. The guy back in third place is looking kind of quick, but kind of looks like he's struggling to set up a pass. 16.775. Low car up high, car stopped ahead, go high. Slow car download. Got some people coming out of the pits, we got a lap car ahead. They are battling for second behind. 
But the three car might be able to catch us. Especially if I make too many mistakes sliding a bit too much if I go low. So we're just going to run up a little higher. 16.831. And then hopefully the six doesn't cause us to lose any time. 2.4 seconds behind. Low car up high. Car stop up high. 16.9. Car stopping up high. He exits out. are swapping back and forth, but 2.2 at the line, so he's caught us a bit. Okay, we got tons of room from that guy, thanks to him. And we're still at 2.2, so feel okay now. We just can't get chicken streakered here. And this guy is taking multiple lines through the corner, so... Just have to watch for him turning down off the corner. going to be a scary one, I think. Hopefully he just goes low, but I'm doubting it. I'm not sure if he can control where his car is going. Yeah, now he's going to go up high, and we're just going to get as low as we possibly can, and thankfully he lifts off and lets us go. So, weirdly, Dirt Legends, we've got some of the most respectful lap cars I've ever seen. Um... That's awesome. I will take it. 2.3 seconds back to second. And... We are good on fuel by a lap. The track shouldn't push up any further than it is. If... This is uh, modeled right. This car shouldn't be moving the track too much. It's already slicked off way too much, I think, for the amount of cars and the size of the tires, but... And the weight of the car. 2.7 back to second. Like, that time keeps changing, but doesn't really look like he's getting any further back. 17.06. So yeah, this setup is uh, three, four years old, I think. 2018, I think, is when it was labeled. So this car hasn't really changed a lot and then since then. But, uh, this is the most balanced I've felt this car, so. Glad I went and looked there and tried it, because what we ran at the Chili Bowl was not good. Yeah, a little loose there. 2.3, so he just every once in a while clicks off a lap. If he's going a little lower, then he can get rain, gain ground, but um, I don't want to deal with the slick at all. He's making it work, he's closing in, but we've got five to go, and we just need to not hit the wall or spin out, and, uh, well... Most of the field's gone. Third place is seven seconds ahead of us. So only three people on the lead lap.
Still haven't screwed up, but I need one more good lap. Yeah. One more time around. Seventeen point two five. You've got about two laps of fuel. And that might be my first Legends win. So um, easy field obviously. We had you won. See you in victory line. Over 2,000. Well, no, I guess we had over 1,400 to the next guy. But uh, for a car that I can never get to feel right, that actually felt good. So, um, yeah, I think we're going to have a few things to look at there. But, I mean, how weird was that? Everyone was respectful, and we didn't... There was really no scary moments there. So, let's see what happened that we didn't see. Got the 9 car. Straight into the wall on the start. Got the 7 car in the 5. Five's getting a little wiggly. 7 goes up and hits the wall. He's just going way too low in the corners. Then the 11 is really struggling. Um, looks like way too wide of field of view. It's usually when I see someone who can't control their car in the corners, where it seems like they're reacting way too late, usually means field of view is all junk because they're trying to see too much. A lot of people hitting the wall, though. Ten car way up top, and then reacting way too late. Probably a field of view issue. Five car getting on the slick. And the eight and the three were battling, and... Yeah, the car shouldn't be turning like that. And then he wipes out the four, unfortunately. And that's seeing it again. The 11, once we got past him, yeah, he's there's no way that the car should be turning back like that. Either field of view or way too much force feedback is normally what I would point out on that. But let's take a quick look at results. And 32 I rating and 14 safety rating. So, yeah, that's good. And we get the fastest lap, all laps led and pull. Very rare I do that, but I guess it takes a uh, 1,300 strength of field race to uh, do that. Three car, though, he was, he kind of had me worried. He definitely had speed if he would have started. I guess he started third. I don't know. I don't know what happened on the start there, but um, I think if he would have been closer, it would have worried me a little more. So I uh, hope you enjoyed that. Something new. So always fun to try out. Thanks for watching.